Hello, Javier. How have you been, Arthur? Okay. You seem well, Reverend? Yes. Well, maybe. I've been okay before, but then I make a fool of myself again. So do I. I went into town. Hello, Mary Beth. Oh, how are you, Arthur? Fine. How are you? Um, well, I'm well, I think. It's been quite a run we've had, but, but we're still alive. Mm. So, no regrets? Regrets for what? Well, for joining this band of maniacs. If you're a girl without means in this world, life is very... All right, head for Rhodes, and quick. She's in Rhodes? No, she's at a place called Radley's house, where you seem to be missing the urgency here. Okay, I think that's the place up ahead. I think there's a guard. I'll deal with him. What you want? Kind sir, we're lost and in need of some help. Well, get out of here. Oh, I see that kindly face of yours, and I know that for the right inducement, a gentleman such as yourself could be mighty kind. Now get out of here. Oh, now you keep saying that. But you don't mean nothing by well, I it. I said... You <coughs> said your last word. Well, what are you waiting for? Get in there and find our girl. Okay, Miss Tilly. Now, let's get you out of here. I thought there was. I... Yeah, it don't matter what you thought. It's okay. All right, let's go. Oh, come along, Miss. Thank you, both of you. What happened? It was Anthony Foreman. He thinks he owns me. I remember. Where is he? He went out hunting or something. There were five of them, I think. Well, we killed those fellas there. There they are. Come on. Tilly, grab that gun. Anyone approaches, shoot them! Oh, don't worry, I'll be just fine. Now catch that bastard. <sighs> the one in front's the ball. Bring him back alive. I ain't done with him yet. All right, get after them. Whoa. There, straight ahead. I saw him go through those bushes. <clears throat> They're coming for you, you bastards! <clears throat> They're heading down the hill to the wall. <clears throat> you got it. One's the boss. Lasso him and we'll take him back to Tilly. Don't let him get away. Don't kill him yet. I want Tilly to have the last word on this bastard. Go on. Rope that bastard. Use the lasso. Don't kill him yet. the boss. Lasso him and we'll take him back to Tilly. Don't kill him yet. I want Tilly to have the last word on this bastard. Tilly Jackson ain't yours to have. I promise you don't want a war with me. You're making a big mistake! Yeah. Don't let him get away! Come here! 
that's it. Now make sure... That's it. Now make sure you tie him up real good. There we go. You son of a bitch! Get this off of me! Are you going to tie him up then? I'll uh, kill you! Make these nice and tight. All right. You bring that bastard back to Tilly so we can all have a nice little chat. I'm gonna head over there now to check she's okay. With pleasure. <laughs> Let's go. You have the first idea what you're getting into. I'm Anthony Foreman. Well, thanks for the introduction, Anthony. Is that Foreman with an E? I want the undertaker to spell it right. Funny bastard to me. Don't feel so good when you're the one tied up, does it? She killed my goddamn cousin. Oh, don't worry, you'll be... All right, here's your man. Bring him here. Dump him on the ground here. I want to get a good look at this monster. Here we go. So he's still alive then? Ah. I guess. You see this girl? You leave her alone. She killed my cousin. Your goddamn cousin had it coming, Anthony Foreman. I don't care if she shot your daddy and cooked your mama for breakfast. She's mine. She ate yours. You know, a friend of mine, he always says, <clears throat> revenge is a fool's game. Now, you want all your boys dead? She had her reasons. We was family, Tilly Jackson. You Foreman boys ain't no kind of family I want. Kill him, Arthur! You want that? I want him to go away and tell the remaining of his cousins and the clowns he rides with to leave me alone! Now, you think you can do that, Anthony? Or should I slit your throat and just save us all the bother? I'll leave you alone. History is done. History is never done. It's your call, Arthur. But I'd slit his throat. Go on. Finish the bastard off. You know my choice. Sadly, I agree with you. <laughs> Sorry, partner. We can't take no chances with the likes of you. Yeah. <laughs> That horse don't listen. 